I just thought of the sixth C. Steve from Mission Uber. It's the YouTube channel that documents my journey out of debt while having a little fun driving Uber as I do it. Thank you, Mr. Dave Ramsey. Be sure you subscribe, hit the notification button, okay? Join the Mission Uber team. A quick video here. I want to kind of introduce myself a little bit more. I have about 30 some videos out at this point, and some of you are getting the gist of why I'm doing this. Of course, I am doing this to get out of debt. That is the main reason. And I want to share with you a little bit about my early stages of the journey, what got me to this point, and I also want to share with you the four C's of getting out of debt. I made it up, so it's it's pretty good. This YouTube channel has been somewhat evolving. You know, I've got a lot of fun stuff. I've got trivia on there. Documenting the rides and the type of people that I have in my car and all that is great. I like to share some Uber tips every once in a while. But getting out of debt is the main reason why I'm doing this. And here's my personal little story and it's not much different than anybody else, okay? I'm in debt and I don't want to be in debt any longer. And most likely you're in debt too. You're okay if you don't have any debt at all. Cars are paid off. Mortgage at the most if you have that. If you have enough income to float you for six months, if something happens, you lose your job, you get sick, you get hurt, you just don't want to work for six months, then you're good to go. Head to your pickup at Clarence Town Court Justice. Ooh, picking up a judge. If you have debt and you cannot survive for six months at least, if something happens, then you should consider watching my videos. <laughs> you should consider visiting Mr. Dave Ramsey. My story. simple I'm in debt <laughs> and I'm tired of living paycheck to paycheck Make which from what I understand about 70% of Americans do that is not cool not cool in the least to be living paycheck to paycheck sorry buddy I'm going and I don't want to live like that no more also I realized that now that I'm in my 40s Retirement really is not that far away. What am I going to do if I retire living paycheck to paycheck? Do I work into my 80s? What do I do? Make sure your man double bags. Last time he didn't double bag and the bottom near came out. Make sure you double bag like the lady says. Understand? Yes, sir. Surely will. I guess it kind of hits you, you know, as you grow older. Us younger folk or the younger folk, they don't really think about retirement. Well, they should. And if you're young, girl, you should start thinking about retirement. The four C's. This is the initial steps to getting out of debt. Yeah, have to be conscious about your debt. You have to realize, oh my God. Oh my God. That's the first C. The second C is you have to cut costs. There are so many cost-cutting things you can do. One of the biggest ones for me, one of the toughest ones, was cable. I had to cut the cable. There are so many other things. There are gym memberships. There are trips to the restaurants once, twice, three times a week. Some people eat out every day of the week. There are trips that you take. There are clubs that you belong to. There are so many things that you absolutely do not need to spend money on when you're trying to get out of debt. The third C is you have to cut up your credit cards. You cannot live 
off your credit cards. It doesn't make any sense to be charging stuff and then paying more for it down the line. True. You buy a flat screen TV that costs $700. By the time that flat screen is paid for, you could pay double. Instead, save the money and buy things with cash. There's a whole another discussion about debt and what debt is. Not going to get into it now. But cut up your credit cards. That's the third C. The fourth C is you want to cut ties. Cut ties with people right that you spend a lot of money with. Now, I don't mean blow off your friends completely. But you know the ones that are talking you out to go out to spend money that you don't have. Right. That's really tough. No doubt about it. That is really, really tough to do. And I'm going to add a fifth C, and that is cut the attitude. Cut the attitude, oh, I got to, you know, I got to have this, or I got to go here. Well, you know, cut all of the, the right. expectations that you have about spending money. I need a new car. Got to go on a trip. Got to do all these things. No, you don't. You really don't. So cut the attitude. Pick up Angelica somewhere around her. Those are the five C's. It was four, but now I'm making a fifth one. The five C's to getting out of debt. Now, it isn't easy. You most certainly have to work on it. And it's a battle up and down and up and down. You'll spend money you don't have. You'll go out with friends and you know you shouldn't. Your attitude will get the best of you. Just keep pushing forward. Keep doing everything you can to get out of debt. It's a Thursday night. I'm out driving. Hopefully, I get some good rides. How you doing? You want to go in or you want to go to the drive Okay. just finished one ride on a Thursday night and it was a $25 jobber. I, was, I like those. Let me pick up where I left off. The five C's. Consciousness. You gotta realize I'm in debt. Cut back. You gotta cut back on your expenses big time, baby. Cut up your credit cards. Cut them up. Cut ties. You've got to cut ties with those things that cause you to spend money. And finally, number five, cut the attitude. Cut out the crap when it comes to spending money. Oh, well, you know, I've had a tough, I've had a tough week. I'm going to go out and, you know, have a few drinks with my friends. Or, you know what, I've been wanting to go on vacation to... Madrid, Spain, or Hawaii, or insert your location here. You're in debt. You can't be doing that stuff. You can't be buying new cars. You can't be spending money, baby. You can't spend money. You can't be going out to eat. You can't be doing nothing. Incorporate those five C's best you can to start the process of getting out of debt. Five C's. The five, I made that up. The five C's. I made up the five C's. Now make sure you subscribe. Hit the notification button. That's super, super important. Hit the notification button. Just do it, baby. Just do it. Just tap the button. No big deal. Maybe give me a like and comment below. Love to hear from you. Steve, Mission Uber. See ya.
I just thought of the sixth C. Commitment! You gotta have commitment!